Be The Game is a company that's, uh, that was founded in 2008, November 25th to be exact, and we focus on building strong kids from the inside out through repetitive acts of kindness. We do sports programs, school programs. We're here today at Pierre Elliott Trudeau celebrating their 21 day Kind Every Time Challenge. 2008 acts of kindness divided by 350 students. These are kids that really took part, really took a lot of heart and soul into this journey. And when we condition the child's mindset to think about helping, not hurting, that's how we truly eradicate bullying across our country, and it's working. Our format's a little bit different than the standard format. Come into a gym, speak to a thousand kids, and rah, rah, rah. We all know kids are gonna be thinking, hey, I wanna go out to recess. What we do is we go from classroom to classroom, five to 10 minute conversation with them. So we converse with them. We don't just speak to them, we speak with them. When in the classroom setting, they're more engaged. They're, they're more free, more safe to actually open up and communicate with us. So we launch each classroom, we nominate the class leader, so a boy and a girl, assuming it's a co-ed school, and they participate in acts of kindness every single day for 21 straight days, including the weekends, but it's really 21 school days. And what's beautiful about our program is that engages the family unit. And that is the main purpose, right? It starts at home. And when we're getting emails from families saying, Mr. Drexler, because of this program, our kids, all they talk about is acts of kindness and what they did at school that day to help each other. Our program is truly going to completely eradicate bullying. I believe it, we're seeing it, and it's just the beginning. The Kindness Challenge is a positive aspect of Bill 56. Bill 56 is the anti-bullying law that we had to respect in every school. But since we always tell children, don't do this and don't do that, we felt we had to give them a positive spin on things. And the 21 Day Kindness Challenge was our answer. Uh, we had this team coming, Be The Game, from Toronto and organize the challenge for us. Each child received a booklet and they would list acts of kindness. We explain what those acts of kindness were, how we do it and why it's important to do it because it's like a ripple effect. You do something and then it spreads around you and it's been very positive. Around the school we felt a much more positive attitude and, and less sort of play fighting at recess. Um, so I think it, it's given results. Uh, in the long run, we will have to keep reminding children, but it's also lined up with our value of the year, which is uh, care and compassion. Uh, well, as a class every day, we took a few minutes uh, out of the schedule to talk about acts of kindness that they recall doing within the last 24 hours. And over and beyond that, we also made acts of kindness posters. Uh, kindness, uh, how the children can show kindness towards the poor, towards the elderly, towards their environment, animals, their friends, their family and neighbors, and everyone in school. So it was uh, kindness all around. All I did, I helped somebody when they got hurt. I helped when somebody dropped something and I picked it up for them. I helped my friend cheer up when people hurt him. I taught my friend how to play volleyball, and I played with Isaac when everybody was fooling around him. I feel the part was helping others. Helping others is better for the world. Contact us uh, through our website, bethegame.ca. Uh, you can contact our director of operations, which is Lynette Rumble, lrumble at bethegame.ca. Schools are lining up. Since we were featured on KNAM, our phones and our emails are ringing honestly 24 7. We'll wake up in the morning, 70 to 80 new emails from schools across Canada. So we're booking right now all year long. We'd love to come back to Montreal, all of Quebec, and let's, uh, let's rock this province.